Ben Jurgen, and I'll be reading for the Undateables pilot. Welcome to the Dan Cave. Did you rob this guy Miles' catalog? It's pretty sweet, huh? That's you. Or a good feng shui. Right. Like feng shui is a real word. The wall's all wired up with, for your flat screen, so you're good to go there. Oh no, I don't watch TV in bed. All research suggests that it negatively affects sleep patterns. Really? That's interesting. Not really. It's sarcasm. So you're gang. They're nice guys. They're sweethearts, but they're the non-superhero version of the Avengers. They're the undateables. They all have their own unique superpower that completely repels any member of the opposite sex. You have the inappropriate one, the picky gay guy, and the church mouse. Well, then you're lucky because I'm certainly not going to force you to hang out with us. No, I'm excited to meet them. Do you see how awestruck they were when Maddie and I were vibing? About that, I don't like to get weird, but Maddie and I are kind of... Really? I knew you had hidden game. I was just worried with the loppers, the bike shorts, the black eyes. Black eyes? But now I know you were playing it cool. The Iceman cometh on Maddie. Oh no, it's not like that. Oh, it's okay. Your wins are my wins now. We're lobos. We're just roommates, kind of how I see it. So you and Maddie, as they would say in the ancient days, washing each other's feet as they as that would say in the 70s, making whoopee, as the Amish would say, doing a little candle making. Okay, I got it, but we're not, like, together. Cool. Casual. Dating with no labels. 